I have always been the asshole of the family. Now that I got money I suddenly have their attention. Throw away because my siblings know my Reddit account. Do you remember the stereotype of the oldest kids that are the victims of all the trauma their parents put them through? It kind of applies to me considering I always was the one to blame for everything. They were nice for the first six years of my life before my twin siblings were born. Suddenly I was the one they blamed for everything. I was the one that had to learn everything for myself. It's like pushing someone in cold water so that they are forced to learn swimming if they don't want to die. My parents did the same except that they didn't stop at swimming. I never got any help for homework. They wouldn't wash my clothes. They just put me in front of the washing machine and told me to figure it out while they took care of my two younger twin siblings. I got a sister and a brother. If you think that that's fucked up that they haven't even told me how to do it, they also never cooked food for me too. They just said I should cook for myself. At eight years old I stood in front of the stove and cried. Didn't know what to do. After half an hour of me just standing there and crying they finally gave me something. This continued for my entire childhood. With my siblings however it went totally different. They spoiled them to death did everything that I wished they did for me and even cleaned their rooms for them because they didn't want them to try too hard. Unlike me they also got pocket money. That was something I could just dream for. I hated my siblings for getting all this while I got nothing even though it wasn't their fault. If my siblings did something wrong they told me that I should have teached them better like it's my responsibility to raise their children. I found a job at 17 and moved out. I couldn't bear it any longer. While life was hard I finally was able find a well-paid job. And from that I started my own business with my best friend. It's a small IT company with only six employees besides us but we make a really well amount of money each month. We even have our own small office. I cut it off the contact with my parents a long time ago after they said that I'd probably crawl back to them after two months because I'd be poor. Not only have I proved them wrong. Right now I make more money each month than both of my parents combined in half a year. And of course they found out about my business. I already expected what they said before I even knew. In a condescending way they demanded that I give them 40 of my monthly income. They say I owe it to them for raising me. I owe those pieces of garbage nothing and I told them that. They call and text me every day demanding more and more money. I cannot stand the audacity of these people. But the best part comes now. A few weeks ago my parents asked me via text message to give my siblings a job at my company because they were terrible at every job they had attended so far. I let them do an internship for a week but figured that they couldn't even clean properly. My parents never teach them and spoiled them so much that they couldn't even handle a regular broom. Needless to say I declined and my parents threw shit at me again. I tried to block their numbers once but they just changed them and tried contacting me again. I will never plan to reconcile. They treated me badly my entire childhood which unfortunately does not exclude physical violence from time to time. They do not deserve my time or my money. I am more independent now than I ever was before and I feel great about myself. I'm proud of what I achieved and I know I am way better than them. Update someone pointed out that my post reached TikTok. Thanks for that. And also thanks for all the positive comments. I want to clarify that English is not my native language. So sorry if there are any mistakes in my post. And I also want to let you know that you convinced me to get a restraining order. I don't know if this really helps because I know them too well. But it's worth a try. Thank all of you three foot.